Let's see, what sort of response have we had so far from Sunday? It's been obviously pleasure yesterday. Um, you know, I obviously had a meeting with the players yesterday and, uh, and told them exactly how it was because the truth is I'm a manager that continuously defends his players and it's been the story of my, my career so far but when you defend people the relationships work both ways I have to see a mirror image of what I expect from the players and unfortunately in certain players I'm not seeing that and the truth is that that certain players will be shipped out of the football club. There's no doubt about it. That's how strong I feel about it. The, an incident occurred after a game which I'm not going to that told me everything that I need to know about certain players. And they'll be gone, they'll be banished from this club. Because I'm not having the way we go about things at this football club, the work that my staff do, the preparation work that we do, the amount of uh, help we give the players, everything geared towards making them better players and this club better and to see that type of performance. At this moment in time, I feel so strongly about this because I think we've got players in this club that it doesn't mean enough to. And I think at this moment in time, the players have got to stand up and show their courage because all the time they're provided for, every aspect of our preparation is proper and they're feeling to deliver certain players and I'm not happy with them at all. That is how strong I feel because we are working our tail off to make this club better. But I need to see a mirror image of that from my players and certain players are letting this club down. Will that be reflecting your, your team selection? To a degree, but not, not the full way because my hands are tied a little bit. I cannot change things immediately. But make no mistake, I will not stand for that type of performance at the weekend. And I will not stand for certain aspects of professionalism when everything is done for these players to make them what I believe elite athletes. We do everything at this club, from GPS, from match preparation, from analysis to detailed training. Never is a stone left unturned. And I expect that from my players. I expect that. That is the least I expect. From a Stephen Presley team, the one thing that I expect is a passion and a desire. And I've seen that for long periods here, but I'm seeing it not enough from certain players. Certain players are in a comfort zone and they'll be gone from this football club. Make no mistake, they'll be gone. What hurt you most about something? Was it the fact that... That we went down with a whimper. That they wanted it more? Absolutely. That they wanted it more. And that will be never said to one of my teams. Never. And never again. So I'll not accept that and I'll make sure that these players understand that and players will leave this football club. Have you, have you conveyed that to the individuals uh, concerned? Absolutely, they know that. It was a frank meeting yesterday, fingers pointed and players told exactly how it is at this club. They know how it is, they know how it is. But there's players at this club that are letting the club down. No doubt about it. I, I will not defend them anymore. I defend these players with my life all the time, but not anymore, because certain individuals are not giving me that back, and this club that back. Was that done on a one-to-one -one basis, or in the, no. the team environment? No, it was done in a team environment. And does that, what's been the effect, have you noticed any effect of the other players? Well, the effect will be what we see in response. But the truth is, you know, you can ask, well, what can you do about these players that, that you can do nothing? The desire and the passion has to come from within. And I told the players, my teams have to mirror what I am as a manager, and far too many of them aren't doing that for me just now. And that'll change. Is it good as a game as quickly after Sunday? For me, absolutely. I can't sleep just now, I'm so angry. I'm so angry about uh, Sunday's performance, so angry that we embarrass this proud football club, that we embarrass everything that we try and do at this football club. Uh, I, I, I can't tell you how angry I am. Hours of sleep, lack of it, because I'm so angry about the whole situation. But change will come. Don't worry about that. I will never accept that again.